Hey guys! Ooh. How's it going? Today I've got something very fun planned. And I. So yeah, let's go transform some animators into monsters. Alright, so first we got our boy the odd ones out. So a boy. Our favorite white blob man, sentient marshmallow, whatever you want to call him. Why do all your characters look like anthropomorphic mushrooms? He'll be our first victim of my monster makeover today. So I'm gonna go off his resemblance to a marshmallow and draw what would happen if, if he was put under the sun for too long. And by that, I mean I'm gonna draw him as a giant, melting, dripping marshmallow man. His body's gonna be literally melting into a pool of marshmallow juice. <laughs> For his head, I'm gonna give him an expression that screams, Help me! Cause, uh, dissolving into a human protein shake is not an enjoyable experience, I imagine. Really like how this is turning out so far. Making him as slimy and drippy as humanly possible. And you know what, if he's gonna be melting, why not uh, liquefy his entire skull cap? Yeah, that really ups the ante. Next up is Ginger Pale, the, the lost aborted child of Green Goblin. I actually remember editing a drawing of him in another video. I never really liked his hoodie thing, so I'm gonna erase some of this. Oh, 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 oh my god! But uh, in that one, I kind of stuck with his existing proportions. So now I want to try something completely different. So first, basic central silhouette. And I'm gonna make all his extremities freakishly long. Actually, these are still a bit on the th thicker side. Maybe I'll have to trim some meat off those sexy struts. That's better. For his little flappy nubs, I'm gonna extend them like wires. Doing a loop-de-loop -loop around the legs gonna do something similar to the end of his hood. And uh, you know that cursed Thomas the Tank Engine meme going around? Oh no 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 no. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Beautiful. This is one of those times where I uh, Question my own sanity. If you showed this to my psychiatrist, she would probably get me locked up in a mental institution. Ah yes, Laddie. Starting off with an OC who's uh, already kind of an, an odd, odd fellow. fellow. She forgot to grow a body, so she's just a big old head with underdeveloped legs. But still, I can work with this. First, let's grow out her hair a bit. Give her kind of a uh, the girl from the ring look, but more curly. And finally, slap on some hyper-realistic legs. Maybe not in a standing pose, she'll be like, floating through some demonic force. Reminds me of that meme of the kid running away from the other kid who has somehow achieved telepathic levitation. Tabs. The animator who always looks like she's- she pretty much says herself that she's a chronic insomniac. So I guess my prompt for this one is, making her the personification of lack of sleep itself. 
Guess we'll start with the eyes. Now we ain't just gonna give her little thin doofenshmirtz eye bags. We're gonna give her the darkest, most sunken pits you can imagine. There we go. You know how you can tell the age of a tree by uh, how many rings it has? I imagine you could tell how many days she hasn't slept by counting all the individual eye bags she's grown. But don't quote me on that. I'm no doctor. I failed chemistry. Here I'm giving her a really bad case of bedhead hair. Developed over years of twisting and turning in bed, desperately trying to find the right position to sleep in, the right temperature. No, I am not talking from personal experience. Why would you think that? Get out of my house. Her body will be slumped in fatigue, her atrophied stickman arms trailing behind her with nails which she has neglected to cut for months. And how could we leave Tabs without her favorite Fortnite weapon? Her wooden baseball bat. Even at such a sleep-deprived state, she's still determined to commit her daily acts of assault and battery. Oh, and one more thing. There. Now it's art. Next we got Katzen, Katzun, Kat Zimbabwe. How do you pronounce it? There's now a Katzun varsity hoodie for the Katzun. Uh, I got two things in mind. I could either make her into a really awesome cat mage or something really majestic, or I could mutate her horribly into a feral feline beast from hell. And you know by now that I'm obviously going to go for the latter. And no, there is no third option to draw. Get your minds out of the gutter, you furries. Here I'm going to make the animal inside really uh, bursting forth like a werewolf, but a cat. Where cat or where cats a thing? Anyways, our Katzen, Katzen. Katzen beast is coming together nicely. Uh, maybe I'll add a tail. Uh, still not right. How about some spikes? My rule of thumb when drawing monsters, when in doubt, add spikes. Curved spikes, straight spikes, blunt spikes. You can never go wrong with some spikes. They're basically the salt of monster designs. They go good with everything and you can always add more. So yeah, this is what Katzen looks like under a full moon. Looks like a hybrid between the Cheshire Cat and the Tasmanian Devil, not gonna lie. Lastly, we got something else YT, and we're gonna turn him into something else. Yeah, I know that joke was way too easy. The uh, only small physical feature that distinguishes him from the other four marshmallow gods of YouTube are those pathetic excuse for horns. They're like the leftover hand-me-downs of what his demon ancestors used to have. They're Essentially vestigial remains at this point. You're a disappointment to your parents, and I intend to fix that for you. You'll be the horniest- Wait, no. You'll be bringing uh, glory to all of demon kind with these new horns. I made them like the shape of an S, cause, you know, something else. Now giving him a face on that tiny head, with an expression that kinda goes, Rocco, why did you do this to me? It's for your own good, pal. This may be a huge inconvenience in your daily life, but at least you'll have the most dank-ass horns on the block. You're welcome. So that concludes our uh, little experiments. And if any of the peeps I've drawn somehow managed to see this, I'm not sorry. Anyways, hey, hey what are you doing? Oh no, not my monster serum! Oh, 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 oh,